The rebuilding of the Reiterbrucker in the port of Hamburg has reached a decisive phase with the lifting elements being swung into place. How important is today for the Hamburg Port Authority and how important is it on the way to realizing Hamburg's vision of the smart port? Well, yes, we talk about the smart port, but here we see that physical infrastructure is important. The Reiterbrugger had reached the end of its working life, having been built in 1934, and we had to rebuild it. And it's an important day because we've put into place one of the lifting rail sections for Europe's and maybe the world's largest double lifting bridges. And we're happy and hope that everything will work so that we can continue to keep traffic moving here. Damit wir auch hier den Verkehr weiterhin im Fluss halten. Herr Kapusta, das Einheben... Herr Kapusta, the mounting of the lifting elements on the one hand, the large dimensions, amazing weights we're dealing with, and yet very precise work. Is that right? That's exactly right. We need to be very precise to place the bridge elements where they need to go. We installed guide rails on the lifting piles, and if it hadn't fit, it wouldn't have worked. And again, and I always seem to ask this, you all seem very relaxed. How do you manage it? Well, that's a good question. I think it's just the way I am, although you do feel a certain amount of tension inside. But you have to keep calm and stay optimistic, and trust in your abilities. That's what I do. That's what the whole team does. It all worked out in the end. Everything went according to plan. So, just how relieved are you? Very, very relieved. So the Reiterbrucker's lifting elements have been successfully put in place, and it really is a masterpiece of logistics. So see you next time, and tschüss, as they say in Hamburg. In Hamburg sagt man tschüss.